Welcome back to Gastronomic. Today's Friday and here's your recipe for the weekend. Today we're going to sous vide a whole chicken. First step is going to be to make a vacuum bag for our chicken. The next step is to seal one end. Sealing. Check that seal. Step three, put the chicken in the bag. All right, so here we have everything that's gonna go into the bag with our chicken. I'm gonna add bacon, Dijon mustard, thyme, rosemary, sage, onion and garlic. It's all going into the bag with our chicken. First thing we'll do is we'll season the chicken with kosher salt and black pepper. Next, I'm gonna go ahead and paint on some Dijon mustard. Now I'm gonna add the onion, the garlic, and the herbs into the cavity of the chicken. just like so. Then we'll take our strips of bacon and just drape them right over the top of the bird. This bacon just gonna render out in the bag and add fat to the chicken. Just a few strips like this will do to get the flavor. Ready to go in the vacuum bag. All right, let's see if we can fit this bird into this bag. Here we are, ready to seal. I wanna clean this bag up a little bit before you seal it. All right, here we go, Mr. Chicken. All right, here we go, all sealed up. We have the water bath ready. We have our chicken sealed in the vacuum bag with all of its ingredients to make it delicious. Here's our immersion circulator. Into the water bath and we'll turn it on, set it for 150 degrees, and I'll see y'all in six hours. All right, welcome back. It's six hours later. I had an outfit change and let's open this chicken up. It was a good idea to have a pan down here because it's gonna get real wet. A little bit of color, not much. All right, so here we have it. Here's our six hour in the sous vide chicken. Sous vide means to cook under vacuum. I cooked this with an immersion circulator set at 150 degrees for six hours. This thing smells incredible. Pull the bacon off here. That was just for flavor. You smell the herbs and the Dijon. But these legs will just pull right off. Oh man. Falls right off the bone. This is gorgeous.
It's so juicy, it's ridiculous. This has got to be one of the tenderest, juiciest chickens I've ever cooked. And I've cooked a lot of chickens. Well, thank you for watching this week's episode of Gastronomic. Enjoy your week, and we'll see you next Friday.